Jamboard is a great tool that teachers are using this year, but you can't create folders in Jamboard. This tutorial is going to show you how to make up for the lack of folders in Jamboard. So I've got Jamboard pulled up right here. We're going to make a folder in the bookmarks bar of Google Chrome. Okay, so watch as I do it here. You're going to want to find a place in here that um, this is your bookmarks area uh, where there is not already something there. Okay, so there, oh, there we go. Right click, and then we're going to go add folder. Okay, we're going to add it to the bookmarks bar. We'll just call it new folder for right now. Save. Okay, it's not going to show up here right away. All right, what you'll need to do is go over here. Again, look. That's that little line there, okay? Find that, not little line, little um, chevrons, I think they are. Scroll down to the bottom, and there it is, new folder. Why they put it there, I don't know. It's a dumb spot. The good news is, though, you can drag it. So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to drag it up here. All right. Now let's name this folder. Let's right-click, click Rename. We'll call it Jamboards. Save. All right, so we're almost there. Now let's open up a Jamboard that you want to put in this folder, right? So we've got a Jamboard, it's open. How do we save this Jamboard to this folder here? Find the lock. Find the lock. Drag it down into Jamboard, let go. Now it's in there, okay? Now we can go back and we can add another one. We can add a million of these, okay? So we'll just add one more, show you. So again, once it's open, find the lock, drag it over. Jamboards, boom, now we got a folder of those two in there. All right, oops. So there you go. That is how you can organize Jamboards using folders in Chrome's bookmarks bar. Give it a try today.